Good morning and welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we're doing a full day of eating. Uh, I've only had my pre-workout meal so far, which is 100 grams of cream of rice with uh, 35 grams of whey. And I should have had peanut butter on there, I just realized, and I've forgotten. Never mind. But that doesn't matter because after training, I need to get food shopping and then I need to go to Technopolis to pick up a scanner because I need to scan some documents. Uh, I went yesterday and it was so busy that I just left because I refused to stay in a car park for an hour and I just literally don't have an hour or an hour and a half to just wait to find a fucking car parking space. However, the Technopolis is luckily just around the corner from my gym. So I'll go either, if I finish early, I'll go get food shopping and then go to Technopolis or I'll go to Technopolis and get my food shopping. Uh, regardless, I'm going to go to Lidl to get a few bits and what I'm going to get from Lidl is I'm going to get a cheese and ham croissant. So I, I didn't have my fats there, so I can have the fats from my cheese and ham croissant. Um, otherwise, my coach has changed my diet around again a little bit. So I will tell you what I should have had, uh, what I'm having instead, because I do l roughly follow the diet, but not necessarily 100% on plan. For example, I'm gonna have some sweet potato instead of rice with one meal, stuff like that. Um, I, I wouldn't necessarily eat what I eat or follow my diet because like I said I have a coach and he literally changes at the moment my diet around every three four days whenever I check in I check in twice a week we reverse dieting um, I'm gonna get a full blood test done tomorrow to test my thyroid my hormones etc etc just to make sure that I'm healthy from that perspective um, to make sure that my lipids and everything is fine and yeah that's basically it so now we're gonna go to pulse train gluten hamstrings and then do all the other things. Busy day, as usual. Again, I'm uh, in a little bit of a better mindset than I was yesterday. Uh, yesterday I was feeling really overwhelmed, uh, which happens sometimes. You know, I'm, I'm human. I also get feelings and emotions, and some days are just sucky, basically. Uh, but so far today is okay. Uh, so yeah, we'll see. There's a few things I want to get ticked off. I'm not as busy with clients either this afternoon, so we'll see. But yeah, so watch this for your entertainment only. You know, uh, I am natural now, but otherwise when I'm prepping, I am I, I take performance enhancers. You know, I'm obviously trying to become a pro athlete. Um, and yeah, you know, anything. I'm just documenting my off season journey, trying to get healthy, trying to get all of that back in place because bodybuilding preparations are unhealthy. Prep isn't like, Bodybuilding itself isn't unhealthy. Obviously, eating right and eating a lot of food and building and training your body, etc. Uh, also, on training, I'm going to be doing a deload because the last few trainings have been really rubbish. I haven't had much strength or energy. Um, could be because of stress, because I'm sleeping a lot. Actually, I'm actually really tired, which also is an indication of potential uh, overtraining. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna not be going ham in the gym. I mean, I'm gonna still train heavy, but not as heavy as I normally do because I feel a little bit overtrained. But anyway, I'm gonna go now. My pre work are starting to kick in, my car is warmed up, and it's time to hit the gym now. So enjoy the B roll coming up.
Right, so finished with the gym and I've got my food shopping. Normally for my post workout I should have a shake. Um I'm gonna have protein pudding and I'm gonna have a cheese and ham croissant. Uh what I'll do is I will cut away some of the carbs from my next meal and obviously I forgot to eat fat in my meal this morning so um but I'm just gonna eat this now and then wait for the techno polis to open so that I can get my printer scanner and then go home have a shark already start doing work basically these spoons are good actually from Lidl but the cheese and ham croissants I don't know what it is but they are they are the best just keep a spare spoon in my car because I put a builder and wipes I also got some Arion which is basically like a it's not a yogurt it's like a fermented milk sort of drink so So good when they're fresh from the oven. Ah. It's kind of messy, especially if you're eating pastries in it. Oh. Well, let's go. All right, so I'm back from the gym. I'm back from doing my chores. I got my scanner. It went really quickly. I had a shower as well, which you probably can't tell because I'm wearing the same clothes. But I didn't. Only wore this to put over. My t-shirt to go to the gym, so it's clean. Because it is put on this morning. Anyway, so my next meal is um, the Vital Oats that I really like with 20 grams of whey protein, 150 grams of egg whites, 50 grams of blueberries. Um, I should have, also 100 grams of pineapple. I should have 100 grams of cream of rice with pineapple, 100 grams, 350 grams of egg whites and two whole eggs. But because obviously I had the croissant, which has fats and carbs in it, I'm having that, I'm not having any, I'm not having the amount of carbs now, and I'm not adding any fats to this at all. So I'm going to eat this, do some editing, uh, then I need to walk the dogs, and then I'll make some more food. I've got some uh, leftover soup, and I'm going to make chicken soup for my next meal. Chicken and veggie soup. And I need to cook my sweet potatoes as well. But that's easy, I just have to stick it in the oven basically. But yeah, many things to do, so I'd best get cracking. Can I help you? Are you two being wiggle tails? Are you two being happy girls? We need to go out soon, I know, but you, can, can, can you wait? Can you wait like 10 minutes? 10 minutes? Can you wait 10 minutes? Hey, this is... Can you wait 10 minutes? Can you wait 10 minutes? I think you can, huh? Why are you such a cutie for? Why are you so cute for? Huh? Why are you such cuties for? Hey. Bum bums. And the cat's on the balcony, I'm sure. Yes, she loves it there. Soon. Soon. Soon we will go. Ten minutes. Give me ten minutes. And then I'll put on some sookies. I will put on some sookies. <laughs> and then we'll go. And then mommy needs to clean in here, yes. Huh? So they got half an hour now. Um, I'm going to have a coffee with some cream on top. Uh, and then I'm going to do some cleaning, but I'm also going to have a little macaroon. And then in, once I've done some cleaning, hoovering, I'm going to make... I've got some soup left over that I made from like carrots and... Uh, what's it called? Uh, it's got carrots, onion, garlic and uh, celery. So I'm going to have that with chicken. So that I don't have to make my sweet potato, because I can't bother to make sweet potato. Um, this has carbs in it, 
and then later I'll have some rice. So I'm sorted for my carbs for today. Um, they're from Lidl. They're well good. The Christmas treats in Lidl are always the best. I know. I'm going to drink my coffee before it gets cold and I'll be back with my next meal. So I've reheated my, my soup here. Um, I put some rice through there, 50 grams, and 120 grams of chicken. So my carb, my proteins have actually been dropped. I should have had with this uh, 15 grams of nuts of some sorts. I had cheese instead. I had some mature um, out Amsterdam. So, and also I fried up this, some fish that I got from the shop this morning, some salmon, and I ate some crispy fish skin. So that's the fats that I'm gonna have instead of this. But it's all good, it's really nice. Because I roasted a chicken the other day, like a whole one. And then when I roast chicken, I like to put like vegetables. Um, through the, um, in, in the pan and then from the, the juices that come from it with the fresh garlic and onion and rosemary and stuff like that I blitz all of that up into like puree and I always make a soup out of like all the veggies and it's a time of year for soups as well so I'm gonna eat this finish uploading my video continue doing some cleaning until my first check-in starts in a, an hour or so so, here, yeah. just the vegetable soup, basically. So my next meal is uh, 400 grams of egg whites, 100 grams of, I was going to say cucumber, there is no cucumber, pineapple, 200 grams of rice, and I also put a jar of kimchi through there, um, and I've got also in there some sugar-free sweet, sweet chili. I'm going to eat that now, I'm going to sit here, because I actually have just a tiniest bit of downtime before my next client. Um, I will also, in a second, hang up my washing help you I mean I need to feed these girls <coughs> soon you have to wait a little bit first mummy eats and then you can eat yeah first mummy eats and then you eat yeah little tripod my little bum bum hey nay nay that's not for you that is not for you so right, so I'm gonna eat this and then I guess I'll feed the troubles before my next client because if not I know that they will probably be making a lot of noise hmm I'll put my lip I've got two more meals left after this oh fuck hmm did you hate it when you bite your lip? yeah hey, you keep biting it so annoying oh. So it's coming up to 6 o'clock and I didn't actually eat that long ago, but I'm still freaking hungry. So, I think I should eat again. But what am I going to eat? That is a question. I'm going to drink some kefir whilst I'm deciding. I'm, I'm probably going to eat some chicken. I've got some chicken left. I might stir fry that with some uh, courgettes. Because my next meal is supposed to be, my next meal is supposed to be only chicken and, and vegetables. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to stir for some courgette with an onion. 
and I'm gonna have a carrot. One of these one of these ones that comes like that. And um yeah. Make some have some chicken. That's exactly what we're gonna do. Have some chicken with courgette and onion. And the chicken should be 120 grams, which I think probably is this pretty much. That's yeah, 80 grams. Okay. Mm. So I'm a little bit short, which means that I will put some egg whites for today. 100 grams. So now I need to hang up the washing that I've been meaning to hang up pretty much the whole day. Walk the dogs and then I get to relax for like an hour and a half. Because I am um, I should have edited the video. I filmed the video, but I've decided not to do it. Because I've decided that the stress is not worth it. So I'm gonna upload a reel instead and relax and have one more meal, I've got one more meal left to eat. So the dogs have had their last walk and I'm gonna have my last meal because it's like half past seven which means that in the next hour or so I'm gonna get ready for bed. Salmon salad, 150 grams of salmon with uh, lettuce, cucumber, onion and sweet chili sauce and some salt. That's it. So this is my full day of eating. Thanks a lot for watching. Um, uh, I'm not too sure what video is next yet, I think Q&A maybe, I'm not sure, um, but yeah, thanks a lot for watching, insert a fish emoji, if you've made it this far, comment, like, subscribe, dislike the video if you disliked it, and uh, yeah, my deload that I was supposed to be doing is clearly not working very well because I already have muscle pain. So what I'm going to do tonight is I'm going to take some extra magnesium before I go to bed. Magnesium citrate to help with my muscle pain. You can do this. I recommend this to my clients sometimes. If you have very bad muscle pain, take a thousand milligrams of magnesium citrate. Just be mindful that it could give you some loose bowels. Some people get bowel problems with um, magnesium. I don't have that problem. But I know for some people, um, magnesium can make them go to the toilet. Anyway, I'm going to eat this. See you in the next video.